Face the first row. Can I be of any help? Oh, yes, please. Could you tell me where Mr. Lockwood is? Lockwood? Yes, Peter Lockwood. I, I think he's one of the ushers. Ushers? Oh, he's the groom. Groom? Of course. Oh, oh, fine. Well, didn't you know he was getting married? No, I didn't. Well, that was a brief encounter. Look, I have to see him right away. A brief encounter? You and Pete? <laughs> well, I don't think I can get to him right now. Uh, look, I have to see him before the ceremony. If he doesn't know about this, it can cause a lot of trouble. Oh, trouble? Oh, please, not today. He can't see anybody. Well, if he knew what I had in this bag, he'd see me. Bag? Now, you stay right here. I'll see what I can do. You. Rolla was right about your harem and your 2,000 numbers, and one of them is here right now. Hey, Pete, that dame you've been fooling around was out in the garden yelling she's going to stop the wedding, and we think she's got a gun. Well, well let's damn. face the truth. Seems as my husband-to-be has another woman. Another Can't you even keep track of them? Now I know why Roland walked out. Will somebody please tell me what this is all about? Oh, there you are, Mr. Lovett. Look out! It's her. Ow! Grab her bag! What are you doing? We'll have no shooting here. I'll get the police when who's guarding the presents. Policeman! Somebody hold her! Oh, well, what are you doing? Oh, stop! There's no gun here. I've never seen Goodness. you before in my life. Shut up. Except this afternoon in my apartment. Well, well that's why I'm here. You ran out on me. Then you don't deny this. Well, deny what? I don't deny wedding day. Oh, June. Wait till she... this gets in the paper. Oh, will you all please shut up and listen to me for a minute? I think I can clear up this whole silly business. 